Small announcement. Recently, I have written a book. The book name called uh, Foundations of UX Research. So this is a book. So this book is available on Amazon and Flipkart. Even in uh, ebook also has been available. So I'm going to share the link in the description. If you want to buy this book, you can check out those links. In today's topic, I'm going to talk about Android framework and uh, inspirational website for automobile interfaces. And I'm going to walk through one of my student project based on the Android Auto. Let's get started. Hello all, I'm Rambal from Aspera. Happy to see you again. So automobile industry is one of the very, very advanced industry and this industry is leveraging the UX EV design very, very advanced level. So currently this domain is uh, deals with electric vehicles. Even in our country, we are using Aether and a lot of two wheelers comes with the battery vehicles or the electric vehicles. So all these electric vehicles have one small display console, right? So that display console is made up of Android Auto. This is reason number one. Reason number two, most of the cars in our country, most of the car, even if it could be a entry level car or the mid level car or the premium cars, there is a display console. That display console is a 10 inch tab kind of a console, right? That display environment or the interface, most of the things are based on Android Auto, but it's been compatible with Amazon Echo or whatever. Right, but predominantly it's based on Android Auto. So that is the reason this is one of the emerging platform. So being an UX and UI designer, you have a very good chance you will be working on this Android Auto platform in near future. So for that reason only, today I'm going to walk through this Android Auto and you can able to understand their grid system and you can able to working on it. So this is Android Auto website. I'm giving the link in the description section. You can go and check it out. So here, this is a car display. It deals with the car displays. You can connect your phone, right? And it's been uh, connecting with the existing. So this Android Auto is being connected, can be connected with uh, existing uh, applications, something like a Google Assistant, Navigate, Communicate, Entertain, right? So these are the things being, uh, can you can able to do it so that you can able to get help from the Google Assistant and you can use the navigation tools to find a better routes so everything you can do it through your display console all right so now i'm going to click on this get started so we need to check the car so check the compatibility and check your phone and you can connect and go so these are the stuff which they have and here they have a couple of other stuff also there all right so this is a website so you can go and check it out so if you are going to searching through Google Android Auto grid system and you will be end up here. So this is a page for your uh, Google Android layout uh, frameworks and here they are showcasing the adaptive and responsive uh, systems and these are the different dimensions and how they are deal with this kind of a breakpoints and everything and here there is a giving a uh, grid system for that and these are the breakpoints here the grid is little bit different from your existing uh, material or your uh, bootstrap so if you are going to view this and you can go through this framework you can be able to understand and you can be able to create the design for android auto all right so this link also i'm going to share it on the description you can go and check it out so this website is nothing but it's called auto interfaces this website is having a huge collection of a different different cars display consoles screenshots so this will be your one of the best reference or resources for your android auto interface design so that if you are going to plan to design for that interface so you can get the reference from here so here they are having the kia motors sorento car and uh, various screens already they had included even the left hand side they have a uh, different aspect so one is a comfort connectivity and uh, various aspects they are collecting the screens and uh, i'm going to show you apps so these are apps interfaces again this is also for the kia sorento and this is a toyota ray 4 so how it looks so you can get the inspiration from this website in various aspects so this Android, not only for the Android Auto, how the auto interfaces will be look alike. So in various aspects and the categories based, they are collecting the 
screens and you can get the reference you can see the reference based on that you can start working on the design one of my student his name is karthik so he made a, a project based upon the android auto framework so i'm going to walk through that so this is android auto car user interface so here he is giving the mock design and he is giving the small about the project and here he is using the what do you call the font colors grid systems and uh, he is showing the app screens and the navigation systems and the phone call so if you are going to receive the phone call how you are going to attend in the call while in the driving all right so and the setting screen and finally he is showcasing the prototype so this is the one you can click all right so a very cool interesting project and this android auto is one of the coolest framework and this is going to be the future of automobile domain and being an ux and ui designer if you know this framework in addition right so this will be adding a value to your career and also if you are working on the project based on this android auto that also creating a value to your portfolio so i am sharing all the links in the description section and if you have any queries we will be discussing in the comments area and keep learning keep explore i will catch you soon with another interesting topic until then bye bye